Welcome back. The idea of collective buying thought to originate in China is a popular way of doing business on e-commerce platforms. Products and services are often available at significantly reduced rates once a minimum number of customers choose to buy. But well, one primary school in eastern China's Jiangsu province has come up with the idea of group buying online courses, aiming to provide better educational resources to students. CGTN's Xu Wenjing has more. Ling Zuming is a primary school student. This is his first year at school, and so far he is enjoying the experience. But apart from classes in school, he also learns at home in the evenings. Tonight's course is seen, and he's learning from a professional teacher online. I learned how to hum tonight, but my favorite online course after school is writing. Now I'm in love with writing. The after-school courses are part of Zuming's primary school's extracurricular activities. What makes it special, though, is that in order to provide better educational resources to students, and due to limited school funds, some of these tailor-made online courses are paid for by both the school and the parents. For this relatively ordinary public primary school, the act of collective buying online courses is quite an innovative idea. We didn't quite understand the meaning of group buying courses, but after a few times trying it out at home, we found our child liked this kind of teaching. He likes the writing class the most, and he learns online from a teacher in another province. His special way of teaching really sparks the interest of our son. Honestly, if he were to learn from professionals like this offline, it would be much more expensive. Chen Hanmin is a newcomer to teaching online, but already he has been impressed by the impact this kind of teaching has had. When we have singing classes at school, it often involves singing in groups. Now with this course, I can give feedback to individual students. Li Xuan is one of the singers currently being taught by Hanmin. His parents didn't even know how well he could sing before he started the online courses. Now he has a bigger dream. I like singing because it makes me happy. To learn new songs makes me even happier. Xu Qin is the pioneer behind the idea of collective buying online courses. He is the headmaster of Changzhou's Beijing Primary School and has been dedicated to educational reform for the past two decades. He's also promoted a better understanding of combining technology with education. We have received more than 150,000 reviews from our students for the autumn semester, all very positive. The group buying idea helps us to complement our pupils' education with things we can't teach them ourselves. Shi School has offered nearly 60 collective buying courses since last summer, covering areas from reading to writing, English storytelling to singing. And many parents are supportive of the idea because the response from children has been so positive. As for Xu Qin, he says he will continue with this program of reform to get the best out of every student. Xu Wenjing, CGTN, Changzhou, Jiangsu Province.